My dear child, before we dive into this message, I need you to listen carefully, really listen. Take a deep breath and clear your mind of any distractions because this message is for you. This is a message I've been waiting to share with you, and it's one that you need to hear right now. I'm going to talk to you about the pain you're going through, and I need you to stay with me until the very end because every word in this message is important. It could be the lifeline you've been searching for. My beloved child, I see the pain you are enduring. I see every tear you've shed, every sleepless night you've had, every burden that weighs heavy on your heart. I know it feels like it will never end, like the pain is a permanent part of your life. But I need you to hear this pain is temporary. The pain you feel right now will not last forever. It may be overwhelming in this moment, but it is not your final destination. If you need God's blessings, then type yes I need in the comments. Stay with me until the end of this message because I'm going to show you how to hold on, how to see beyond the pain, and how to trust that brighter days are coming. You see, pain has a way of distorting your perspective. It makes it hard to see past the hurt, to believe that there is anything else beyond the suffering. But I promise you, there is so much more waiting for you. The pain is only temporary, a passing storm in your life. But the love I have for you, the strength I will give you that is eternal. And now, my child, I know that in your moments of deepest pain, you've questioned me. You've wondered why I would allow you to go through such suffering. You may even have felt abandoned by me, like I've turned my back on you. But I am here to tell you that I have never left your side, not for a single moment. Please don't give up on me because of the pain you endure while you are on this earth. I know it's hard. I know it feels unfair at times. But I need you to trust that I have a purpose for everything, even the pain. I am not the source of your suffering, but I can use it to shape you, to mold you and to strengthen you in ways you cannot yet imagine, my child. Keep trusting in me, even when the pain seems unbearable. The path you're walking may be difficult, but I'm walking it with you. I will never leave you, and I will never give up on you, no matter how dark things may seem. I need you to stay with me until the end of this message because I'm going to show you how I'm working behind the scenes, even in the moments when you feel most alone. I know you've asked, why? Why am I going through this? Why is this happening to me? It's a question you've asked in silence, sometimes with anger, sometimes with despair. But here's what I need you to understand. Pain has a purpose. It's not pointless. It's not without meaning. I never allow my children to go through something without reason. The pain you're experiencing is refining you, like gold in the fire. It's burning away the things that are holding you back, strengthening your faith, and teaching you lessons that will serve you for the rest of your life. The person you're becoming through this pain is stronger, wiser, and more resilient than you ever were before. Pain has a way of drawing you closer to me. It strips away all the distractions all the things you thought you could rely on, until you realize that I am your only true source of strength. And that's where the transformation happens. That's where you begin to see the incredible power that comes from leaning on me. I know it's hard to see the purpose in the midst of your suffering, but I promise you it's there. Stay with me until the end, and I'll help you understand how every tear, every struggle, Every moment of pain is preparing you for something greater. Here's something I need you to know deep in your heart. You are not going through this alone. I am with you, and I will strengthen and uplift you. You may feel weak right now. You may feel like you're at the end of your rope, like you have nothing left to give. But that's when my strength kicks in. When you are weak, I am strong. When you feel like you can't take another step, I will carry you. When you are at your lowest, I will lift you up. 
You don't have to do this on your own. Lean on me. Let me be your source of strength. I created you, and I know exactly how to restore you. I'm going to show you practical ways to lean into my strength, to let go of the burden you're carrying, and to find rest in me. My child, I am here to strengthen you, not just physically, but emotionally, mentally, and spiritually. I will give you the endurance to keep going, the courage to face your fears, and the peace that surpasses all understanding. My child, I don't think you realize how deeply you are loved. The love I have for you is beyond anything you could imagine. It's not dependent on how well you perform, how strong you are, or whether you make mistakes. My love for you is unconditional, unwavering, and eternal. There is nothing you could ever do to make me love you less, and nothing you need to do to earn my love. It is freely given because you are my child and I created you with a purpose. Every part of you is precious to me, and I see beauty in every piece of your journey, even the painful parts. You are loving my child. You are cherished. And I need you to know that love is what will carry you through the darkest times. When you feel unloved by the world, remember that I love you. When you feel like you're not enough, know that you are more than enough in my eyes. I'll help you see how my love is working in your life, even when you can't feel it. I will show you how to open your heart to my love and let it heal the wounds that pain has left behind if you want God's grace always upon you. Then please consider to support our ministry by clicking thanks button. My beloved, pain has a way of distorting how you see things, including how you see me. When you're in the middle of suffering, it's easy to think that I've abandoned you, that I don't care about your struggles, or that I'm punishing you. But nothing could be further from the truth. I am not distant from your pain. I am right there in the middle of it, holding you, comforting you, and guiding you through it. Don't let the pain you're experiencing cloud your vision of who I am. I am a God of love, of compassion, of mercy, and I care about every detail of your life. I know that pain can make it hard to see clearly, but I want to assure you that I am for you, not against you. I am working all things together for your good, even when it doesn't feel that way. Please, my child. Don't let the pain drive you away from me. Let it bring you closer to me, because that's where you will find the peace and strength you need. You may feel lost right now, like you're wandering through the darkness with no sense of direction. But I need you to know that I have a plan for your life. It may not look the way you expected, and the path may be different from what you imagined. But I promise you, I'm leading you somewhere beautiful. The pain you're feeling now is part of that plan, not because I want you to suffer, but because I know what's waiting for you on the other side. The lessons you're learning through this pain are equipping you for the future I have prepared for you. And trust me, my child, that future is brighter than you can imagine. I am not done with you yet. There is so much more to your story, and this pain is just one chapter. Stay with me until the end, and I'll help you see the bigger picture, the plan I have for your life, and the incredible things that are still to come. Pain, though hard to endure, can be one of life's greatest teachers. It teaches you empathy, resilience, patience, and most importantly, dependence on me. When life is smooth, it's easy to forget to rely on me. But in moments of pain, you are reminded that I am your strength, your comfort, your source of hope. My child, don't waste the lessons pain is teaching you. Every tear you've cried, every sleepless night, every battle you've faced, these are all shaping you into the person I created you to be. You are being refined, like gold in the fire. And when you come through this, you will be stronger, wiser, and more compassionate. I'll help you understand the lessons you're learning through this pain. I'll show you how to use these lessons to grow, to become the person you were always meant to be. 
I know it feels like the pain will never end, like you're stuck in an endless cycle of hurt and disappointment. But I want you to hear this loud and clear your breakthrough is coming. You may not see it yet, but it's on its way. Every step you take, every moment you hold on, is bringing you closer to the victory that is just around the corner. I know it's hard to believe that when you're in the middle of the storm, but trust me this is not the end of your story. The pain you're feeling now is leading you to something greater. The breakthrough you've been praying for is on its way, and when it comes, it will be more than you ever imagined. My child, if you remember nothing else from this message, I need you to remember this. I love you. I have always loved you, and I always will. There is nothing you can do to change that. My love for you is not dependent on your performance, your strength, or your ability to endure pain. It is unconditional, unwavering, and eternal. You are my beloved child, and I take great delight in you. Even in your pain, I see you. Even when you feel unworthy, I love you. Even when you feel like getting up, I am holding you close. My dear child, I know the pain you are enduring feels overwhelming. But I need you to hold on to this truth. Pain is temporary. It will not last forever, and I will not leave you in the midst of it. I am with you, strengthening you, uplifting you, and carrying you through every trial, every heartache, every moment of suffering. Please don't give up on me because of the pain you endure. Trust that I am working in ways you cannot see, preparing you for a future that is filled with hope, joy, and purpose. You are loved deeply and unconditionally. And I will never let you go share this video with up to five people, if you need God's presence. Amen.